this works. Well, you didn't go, did you? Yeah, I, was, I didn't go. Where were you when we went to Office Works? I was at art class. Yeah, so the older three boys have been doing a little um, art class this term. Yeah. Yeah. So the boys love doing art. They've actually done a course here uh, last year. You did a term at the art place as yeah, well. Yeah, an artist. Yeah, but they um, did comics. They did comics last time. This time they're doing an art course, and it's a homeschool group, um, which is cool. So there's other homeschool kids there and everything. So the um, older three boys are doing that because it's just for their age range, um, and it's a drop and leave thing. So um, they go there for an hour and a half once a week, and we take the others somewhere else, just whatever else we have planned. This week we had a special visit to Office Works. I love it. Works. And Evan was a little bit bummed actually that we went without him because he really wanted to go to Office Works, didn't you? Yeah, but it's okay. We can go a different time. We will go another time. What is it that you wanted to buy from Office Works? I actually forgot. I just like looking at all the art stuff there. It is pretty cool. Office Works is pretty fun. There's something for you, Evan. That I'm not sure how excited you'll be about it. Is. Math! It's the best subject. <laughs> Is that your favourite? Mm -hmm. So it's a maths workbook and it's for year six because Evan is in year six this year. And at the moment he's still finishing off some of his year five books. But I think this is the first year six one we've gotten for you because our school year starts in January. Well, we also got one for uh, Otto and then we got one for Felix and we got him a year five as well because he typically does work at maths a little bit above where he's at which is the great thing about homeschooling they can just work wherever they're at just to give you an example of the sort of content in here and then we also got a bunch of books for the triplets too I remember I did those you do yeah it says ages six to seven the triplets are seven we got three of these and these won't be their main maths books, but these ones were quite cheap and they just look like a bit of fun. Um, so they're not super um, difficult. They'll be good for days where we want to take it a little bit easy. And then we also got these ones, similar thing, like fairly simple inside. This one says it's for ages six to eight. So you've yeah, got three of those, all of the triplets. And then another one, which is beginning reading. And these were pretty cheap. I swear they're like $4 each, which is a lot cheaper um, compared to most of the school books we buy. Most of them are 50, between $15 and $30. Some of the more expensive ones can be $30 each, which when you've got six kids homeschooling, it can add up. But these ones are obviously a lot shorter, so it's not gonna take them long to get through all of this sort of stuff but it is good to have as much of it on hand as possible next thing i just got these little exercise books and i thought that i could use these for spelling mini erasers are they mini here you go mm -hmm. you guys just always are looking for erasers so so we've got a sharpener, a sharpener. Here. another one then i just got some um like sight uh, flashcards. So these flashcards are right and wipe. These ones are going to be for the triplets. A subtraction and addition. So we write the answer on there and we can wipe it off and that'll be good just to do some basic practice. Then I actually got these ones for the twins um, or you know whoever wants to look at them really but these ones this is emotions on this one so that's what they look like inside and then the alphabet. This one is numbers, colors and shapes so that was for the twins too. And that is all we got at Office Works, and it came to $131, so it's not too bad for all of that stuff. At the moment, it's Saturday again. I feel like last time we vlogged, it was also a weekend, but sometimes it is the only opportunity I feel like we have um, to slow down a little bit. And the kids were watching Totoro this morning, the little ones were, and then some of the triplets, and Sylvie were doing a coloring in sheet, a Totoro coloring in sheet. And what were you doing? Um, me, Otto and Felix were doing one piece colouring in sheets. Hmm, so they were colouring in a one piece colouring in sheet. So what did you get recently? Do you want to show us what you got recently? The manga? Yeah. So right up here, we're going to have all of them because we're reading them. So the boys love reading manga. You guys have probably seen in some of our vlogs that they have different manga sets. 
Um, Evans just said that some of these are in his bedroom. 22 so and 21. They're not in here, but we recently got the One Piece manga, or at least the first, um, the first 23 out of how many? I don't know, actually. Over 100, I think. Mm, there's a lot. Uh, if you guys didn't know, manga is backwards, so you don't read it like this. Like, that's the back of the book. That's the front. And you read it like this. You've got to read it backwards, too. So it starts yeah, from the back. It goes um, here, here, here. Yeah, yeah. Probably confusing to get the hang of it, but once you get the hang of it, I, and the, after I get after I read this whole thing, I started reading all the books again. <laughs> I kept accidentally starting the back. <laughs> That's so funny. I could imagine that. Just the older three are reading these at the moment because they are not appropriate for younger children. They do say they're rated T for teen, but they've read heaps of different manga. As you can see, all of these collections up here. What's your favorite manga? One Piece. One Piece. What was your favorite before we got this one? Dragon Ball or Fairy Tale. Fairy Tale is really funny. We also have Naruto and Sills at Work, and we also have this funny Kirby manga. Oh, yeah. It's really, really, really funny. Kirby, the manga mania books. Yeah. Are those backwards or are those just They're forwards? Backwards. Are they? Yeah. Okay. Oh, beautiful. I love all the colors you've used. And that one's girl. Oh, you see the girl, May? And this mummy. Oh, I think that's her sister. Sister. Yeah, and who's this? Totoro. Yeah, that's Totoro. That was his Totoro. Yeah. And that was Totoro. Oh. Oh, you hold the pencil from there. Yeah, you did hold the pencil and then you coloured it in, didn't you? So Pearl is doing Kodoro as well. Yeah. <laughs> and have you finished yours, Henry? Yeah. Beautiful. And it says my name on the back. Oh, that's great. And Evan's one piece colouring in. I'm doing one too. And Otto is also doing a one piece colouring in. And so is Felix, um, he's disappeared for now. And then Rufus is just about to start his coloring in as well. What are you reading? Um, that was blue. Yeah, bluey. Birdie's reading blue too. Birdie's reading bluey. Oh, don't bend it that way, Birdie. What have you got? I got happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday, is it? This is blue. I think that's muffin. I think. I don't actually know 100%. That's not. Boy. Maybe it's not. That's my thing. Oh, what that's, have you got, Bertie? That's wearing glasses. Yeah, someone's wearing glasses. And what are they eating over here? Eating the snacks. What are they eating? Eating muffins. <laughs> I think muffins the character's name. Looks like they're having some icy poles. Yeah, do you like icy poles? And that What's wrong grapes that go grapes? Do you think it's grape flavour? Oh, maybe. <laughs> and what about this one? Mm, Papa likes this one. Papa likes the pear one. That's a pear one, is it? What about over here? Papa likes the carrot. Oh, carrot, okay. Papa likes... Pies 
socks on. Because you're listening to me. You have some white fun. Socks what have you got, Birdie? I have this. I bet I'll if you stand up. Right. She'll be wrong. Yeah. <laughs> you gonna try it? Alright, let's see. Because she's not usually Why? allowed paper books. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Grapes. Don't bend it that way. That's not how we um, read the books. No, we don't bend it back because then the spines can snap. The birdie's actually getting a bit better with the paper books, but as you can see, she just bends some of like the colour and paper. I don't think we have any grapes, Bubby. You look like a grape. Felix said that I'm um, me and Cosmo are matching. So. Oh, you are. <laughs> Cosmo, look, you're matching with Daddy. Yeah, you're wearing purple and Daddy's wearing purple. You guys have the same shirt. What are you reading, Birdie? Birdie's wearing. What is Birdie wearing? Birdie wearing. Birdie wearing. There is a cafe. Anyway, guys, we're going to end this video here. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Turn it off now. Bye. Turn it off now.